Good morning. And so here I am at 2225 South Preakness. I did verify this HOA is um, not super strict and they do allow for shops and a couple of these neighbors do have it. Nice, quiet little neighborhood, beautiful home. Actually, it's funny, I realized my cousin lives down on this other street. They've lived here for years. Um, three car garage, stone in here at the front here. The paint looks in good shape. Uh, nice, Some nice mature landscaping. Coming in, I didn't turn lights on, I just, um, I'll do that in a second. Um, so as you enter, where are the lights? It's gonna take me a bit. As I enter the door, there is a staircase that goes up and down the other side and then up. Off to the right hand side, we have a living room. This could be living and dining if you wanted, like formal dining, or you can just kind of use it as they are, just a large room. Um, I don't know if that stays or goes. Um, I would assume it stays. It's attached. So it's got a, I think that, um, I'll have to check. That looks like it might be a, it could be a gas. I think that's going to run from gas, but I will check that for you. Um, then off to the left-hand side is a, one of the bedrooms or a study. This would probably make a nice office here. Ceiling fans, ceiling fan in the other room as well. These are um, two and a half inch um, wood blinds. It's got, a, it's got a closet, so that never hurts. I'm gonna skip the staircase for now and continue going. We've got a little half bath here. Sorry, the loo is up. Wood floors. Little closet under the stairs. Little storage. And then this has one step down, two steps down. Here's your family room, gas fireplace. It's got a closet in here. I'll finish this. I'm gonna go and do the rest of the house. Couple steps back up. I'm on the main level again. Here's the kitchen. We got solid granite surface. Got a little wear and tear here. This is down to the finish, so um, the floors definitely need to be refinished. Uh, the granite looks in good shape. The cabinets are nice. Looks like they're maple. Um, I don't think this comes with the fridge and the. Uh, it's not showing included or excluded. So I'm going to assume the fridge refrigerator is not staying. This is a gas range, single oven, microwave, and they're all stainless appliances, GE profile. And oh, the, that's a Kenmore. Um, that's GE profile as well. I am going to go out there in a bit. That's gonna be video two, the exterior. So here I am looking up to the front door. Here's that living room again. Here's a little staircase. Here's the pantry. Nice and deep. Going up the stairs. Kind of how that looks. Um, turn these lights on. As I hit the top of the staircase, off to the right is the master bedroom. It's a nice large room. Looks to be about 16 by 14. Ceiling fan, vaulted. Nice big windows. I'm gonna look out into the yard. Just a, oh. oh, what's going on there? Something is going on that it's not opening. I'll have to mess with that. Oh, I think they have it tied up there. Um, just a little wear and tear here, just a little paint. But for the most part, the paint looks pretty good. Double vanity, laminate counter, vinyl flooring, look like tile, nice corner tub. Now this does have tile on it. Shower. Walk-in closet. Uh, 
And here's the loo. Privacy glass. Sorry, this is, it's really doesn't feel dirty, but it's, you know, I don't, this is not what I consider show ready, but that's all right. I'm not hiding anything, that's for sure. Okay, and then at the end of the hall, we have a bathroom. And we have a bedroom over here, bedroom over here, and bedroom over here. So I'm going to go off to the right to start with. This was a little girl's bedroom. The walls do need to be repainted badly. It's got this little border and this little pop out here that's pink. Uh, most of this is just cosmetic. Uh, carpets look quite good actually. So it's really, this room needs to be repainted though. And unless you or just like uh, blue with, with a little wallpaper border in here, this room might need to be repainted as well. Um, let me look at some of the closets just to kind of show you how they're built out because these look pretty nice and big. So it looks like you've got double hanging there and you've got a rack in the center and then you've got the single hang on that side. And I'll look at another closet, but I assume they're all the same. The, this door actually looks like it needs to be, um, it needs another coat of paint too. I can kind of see the grain through it, uh, which is interesting. And then look at this trim here. So most of this is very cosmetic. It does have a ceiling fan in here. Ceilings look good. Um, right here, we're gonna have a hall linen closet in between these two bedrooms. I'm gonna back up so you can really kind of get a sense of where we're at. That's going down the hall towards the staircase. Bedroom, bedroom. Then we've got this bathroom in between, a single vanity. Vinyl flooring, laminate counter. A little bit of wear and tear on this wood. This looks a little dinged up by kids, but that could be restained. Just an insert, which those are kind of nice. I'm not seeing anything. This is, like I said, in this room, and the paint looks good. I'm not seeing anything that's really scary yet. Got another closet here, another linen. So we've got side by side linen, so you got plenty of storage. And then we have another room here. It looks like she sews in this room. This is going to need um, a paint job as well, most likely. Um, I think floors could be cleaned up pretty well. Nothing that I'm seeing that way. Looks like closet outlet or um, layout is the same. The double hang, the center, and then the long hang. So, um, ceiling fan in this one too. That uh, little girl bedroom did not have a ceiling fan. So, three bedrooms up here with a bathroom, two linen closets, master bedroom, full bath, walk in. Little decorative ledge up here. Kids would love to jump off of that, so luckily you don't have someone that little. And then I'm gonna do video two to do the exterior and I'm gonna go into this room and explore some more.